In Aus, the second largest city in Denmark, they like to bike so much that the population of Aus bikes a distance equal to 21 times around the world each day. More than a third of the people in the city bike on a daily basis. With an increased number of bicyclists, the focus on traffic safety has increased. As a result, Denmark now has the lowest number of fatal accidents involving bikes in Europe. But promoting the bicycle as a healthy and CO2-neutral alternative to driving does not come without its problems. The town is running out of bike parking space. I needed to go to the doctor and I spent like 10 minutes walking around here trying to find a space. There are more than 9,000 parking facilities for bikes within the city limits, but a recent poll shows that the majority of citizens are unsatisfied with the number and placements. This is one of the challenges people face daily near the train station, downtown Oz. Even though it's winter and snow on the ground, it's still hard to find a free spot for your bike. And the train station is the center of the problem. Due to its central location at the entrance of the shopping street and the many daily visitors, it is a natural bike magnet. Aarhus is a city where there are many cyclists. And that means that parkeringspladsen kan ikke lige være ved hoveddøren for alle. Så, det, så man skal ligesom acceptere, at, at man skal lige gå et lille stykke. To avoid the bikes piling up, the train company, DSB, constantly monitors the bike racks outside the station. Each day, they send a van to remove any that are not parked properly. But removing the bikes from the train station does not solve the problem for the rest of the city. Nu har vi jo fået ryddet op her, men dermed er cyklerne jo ikke forsvundet. Altså, der er jo, hvad kan vi sige, området omkring banegården jo fortsat problemer med, at der ikke er, øh, kan man sige, parkeringspladser nok til cyklerne. Og det betyder så, at så flyder cyklerne jo der. Så, øh, så der er bestemt behov for, for flere cykelparkeringspladser. Aarhus and DSB is working together to solve the problem in the future. But until then, the citizens of Aarhus have to accept the lack of bike parking in the city. From Aarhus, Denmark, Agafa Achaboy.